Today on Two Crazy Kitas, we're gonna try some pumpkin spice mug cake from Primal Noms. We are about to get our fall on right, right after, after this. this. Hey, what's up, family? I'm Rachel. And I'm Joe. And we are Two, Two Crazy, Crazy Kitas. Kitas. If you're new to our channel, welcome. Here on Two Crazy Kitas, we do different things like recipe videos, we do product reviews, we talk about various keto topics, and then every Monday, we sit down on the couch for Keto on the Couch. We just kind of talk about what's going on in our lives for the week. You can find us on different social media platforms like Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And we have a website, which is twocrazyketos.com, and that's where you're going to find all of our different recipes. Now, we do upload at least five new videos every single week, so make sure you subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to hit the little bell icon, and that way, every single time we upload a new video, you'll be alerted to it. Yeah. So today we're going to try a new flavor mug cake from Primal Noms. This is the pumpkin spice flavor. Which I am so excited about because I am all about pumpkin spice muffins. I really honestly have missed them because I was the person that as soon as Dunkin' Donuts would release it for the season, I would like head to Dunkin' Donuts and get the pumpkin muffin. And I haven't been able to have pumpkin muffins well, in like we two handled years. The, we handled the coffee with the, yeah. with the super creamer. If you haven't seen that review, we'll put it up over Rachel's head. Yeah, because I also like the pumpkin latte that they have. Yeah, so I'm excited about this. So if you don't know what Primal Noms is, these are individually packaged mug cakes, and they actually have full-size cakes now as well. Which I cannot be, like, left alone with. Yeah, but these are individual mug cakes. You basically take this package, you mix it with a couple of ingredients, stick it in your mug in your microwave, and you're all done. And it's great as, like, little gift options. You can buy a couple of these like this. They have a bunch of different flavors. Yeah. And stick it in a mug, put a little wrap or a ribbon around it, and earn a little gift bag and give it away to somebody who's on keto. I think that's adorable. And we actually got to meet one half of Primal Noms, Allie, over at uh, KetoCon. Yep. Delightful young lady. Absolutely awesome. Just loved getting to spend time with them. So it's a great company and it's a great product. Yeah, so we actually got this in our keto box and I was super excited to see it because we haven't had one in a while. No. And before opening up, I actually reached out to Allie on Instagram. I'd actually already been talking to her because I heard she had a new flavor. Mm -hmm. And uh, so we're going to do a giveaway with this. So, Yay! Because she's like, do you want me to send you one? I'm like, hey, I've got one. So instead of sending me one to try, I'll I'll try the one that I've got yeah. and you send me one to give away and she was like I'll do better than that we're gonna give away three so at the end of the video we're gonna do a giveaway and the winner is going to get to pick any three flavors of the Primal Noms off their website Wow and Allie will mail them directly to them because they don't just have pumpkin no they have a bunch your, of different flavors that's not your jam they yeah. have lots of stuff yeah we'll go over all the flavors after when we get into the five things review so on the back here it says directions what you need two tablespoons of butter or oil one egg, one mug, one pouch of the cake mix. Wait a second. Do you think that we have a mug, some butter, and um, an egg in this You house? think? I'm pretty sure we can scrounge one of those things I up. I think we got We even have crazy mugs. <laughs> okay, so you melt two tablespoons of butter or oil in a mug. You crack one egg into your mug. You pour in your primal noms and you stir well. Microwave for one minute to one and a half minutes depending on your microwave. I think even Rachel can handle that. So, yeah, we're going to go make that. So, that's on the bottom. Our story with a family history of cancer and diabetes. We started our ketogenic journey so we could be around for our grandkids. I love that. We hope our products help you become the healthiest version of yourself and have more time for uh, with those that you love. How precious is that? Absolutely awesome. So, we are going to go make this in a microwave. If I remember right, the last time we made one, we made it with oil. So, today we're going to make it with butter because there's nothing better than butter. Butter is better. Yeah. So, we will be right back. Okay. Tatooine mug. It smells incredible. It really does. When I took it out of the pouch, I was like, oh my gosh. So, and I've ripped the nutrition label, but I brought both pieces so that I can read it. <laughs> okay, so here we go. Look at that. I purposely made it like, it's I put it for like gooey. an hour and 15 seconds. I mean, a minute and 15, an hour. A minute and 15 seconds it because be I like it kind of gooey. Me too. So that is what we've got. All toasty, warm. Oh my goodness! It does, it smells. This whole place smells like a candle, like a pumpkin candle went off. Wow. wow. That is hot. Wow. Well, it just came out of the microwave, so. You ready? Yeah. Wow. Mmm. 
Well, that's got a perfect like spice blend. It's not overly pumpkin spicy. It's like perfect. Have you ever had like too much of like the pumpkin spice and it's like, oh my gosh, mm -hmm. like might as well be hot sauce. That is like super moist, mm. like super moist. Mm. I mean, you can almost, can you hear it? It is like super moist. That is delicious. Wow. That is del That's crazy good. Mm-hmm. Wow. That is a win. Okay. You want to put this through our five things? Five things. Five things. So if you're new to our channel, we review all products based on five. I saw that. We review all products based on five things. We talk about the ingredients. Does it keto based on a nutrition label? How does it taste? How much does it cost? And finally, would we recommend it? Wow. So number one, the ingredients. What's in this thing? Okay, so. Magic. The ingredients in this Unicorns. are. Unicorns. Allulose, almond flour, dried pumpkin, coconut flour, pumpkin pie spice, baking powder, salt, stevia leaf extract. You can really taste actual pumpkin in there. Yes. It tastes like, yeah, homemade. I mean, I've made pumpkin mug cakes using canned pumpkin, mm -hmm. and they were good, but I mean, this is really good. It this really has really a good. nice pumpkin taste. Yeah, especially considering she's using dried pumpkin. So. Yeah. So yeah, I think the ingredients are really good. I like allulose. I'm, I need to start cooking with allulose more because it doesn't have that cooling effect mm -hmm. on it. You just have to get past the whole idea of that allulose is like listed as a sugar on a nutrition label. So, yeah. so but yeah, overall the ingredients are really, really good. Great Super ingredients. Super clean ingredients. So number two, does it keto based on a nutrition label? And here's where I ripped the label. <laughs> so one prepared cake, okay? Mm -hmm. And uh, on the pouch, it only has prepared. It doesn't ha have how much is in the pouch. So you're factoring in the butter and the egg. Yeah. So just, it's a, it is a little misleading when you look at this. And that was something that the first time we tried it, we're like, hey, wait a second. You know, what's going on here? So the ingredient label is for making it as directed. Right. Okay. 390 calories, 36 grams of fat, 18 grams of saturated fat. We've got 11 grams of protein. 28 total carbohydrates. Remember though, there's four grams of dietary fiber and then it says 22 grams of sugar, but 20 grams of that is allulose. Right. Okay, so you have a total of four net carbs because you can subtract allulose even though it has to be listed as a sugar. And even with four net carbs, it's got, there's a nice big muffin. Yeah. You're getting a lot for those four carbs. Yep. So overall, yes, a keto is based on a nutrition label. It is a little high in total carbohydrates because it is a lot of allulose. Yeah. But I mean, it's just got the perfect flavor. Now Sweetness. net carb, four net carbs is perfect. Yeah. But if you're a total carb person, you got to get, might have to think about it. Yep. So number three, how does it taste? It tastes really nice, homemade. Yep. Like someone is making it that knows what they're doing. Not yeah. like Rachel homemade, like like real homemade. And I think that this would be such a nice thing to have for for not just Halloween, but Thanksgiving, mm -hmm. Christmas. I mean, it's delicious. Yeah. It's nice to just have these kind of in the cabinet and like, hey, I need a mug cake. I don't feel like pulling out all my almond flour and all the other stuff. I don't yeah. have, I don't even have allulose in the house. I don't keep allulose in the house. I'm telling you, sometimes during the holidays, you're watching one of those Hallmark movies and the mood just strikes you and you're like, man, suddenly I feel deprived. I see them like, you know, presenting all these baked goods and I don't have anything. It's nice to have this in the closet. You can pull it out. It's going to taste delicious and you don't feel deprived and you don't like have to go off plan right. in order to have something sweet. Yep. So number four, how much does it cost? So on the website, they ha it's actually, I don't know if it's now her current price or it just says it's on sale. Uh -huh. uh, normal price is $20 for five of these, which would make it $4, four a piece. muffin, but they're on sale right now for $17.99 for five of them. Okay. So what does that come out to be? Uh, three fifty. Yeah. So yeah, now that now you're in a good like keto snack price. Range. And you can think of you know is that expensive? Well, some people may think it's a little expensive. You still have to buy the butter and stuff. Mm -hmm. But how much does it cost to go to Starbucks and buy a muffin or something like that at Starbucks? Panera bread. And are you buying a big giant bag of you know allulose to keep at home or something right. like that? So you may Probably be able to no. make it a little bit cheaper, but you got to buy all the ingredients and keep everything in the house and everything and else. And have a perfect blend like this is. And again, I love the fact, especially for the price, that I can buy a couple of these 
stick them in a little mug like this, mm-hmm. wrap it up, yep. and give it away as a present to somebody who's on keto. Or... I think that's, you know, I think honestly, that is a great way to start somebody even thinking about keto because one of the things, you know, once you know, people are thinking about bacon and eggs and getting over all of the fat that you're going to consume. What kind of treats can I have? What kind of treats can I have? And then if you can give them something that tastes really good, they're probably more likely to give it a shot. Yeah. So number five, would we recommend this? Definitely. And I think we just pretty much covered everything we were talking about in the recommend. I would absolutely recommend it, especially as a gift or if you're somebody who doesn't know how to throw together a bunch of ingredients or you don't want to store all that stuff. I know for me, I mean, I store all of that stuff in the house, although I don't have allulose. Mm -hmm. I keep a lot of the almond flour and stuff because we do recipes on our channel. Yeah. But, you know... I could also be afraid that if I have all of that stuff, I'd be constantly making desserts and stuff like that. So to me, this is a perfect thing to have. And then you don't have to worry about overdoing it or something like that, making all your own desserts all the time. Well, and I think about people who are involved in like cookie and muffin and dessert exchanges, you know, and they don't want to stop that tradition. They like that tradition. And maybe you're used to, you know, putting together a cookie recipe where you've got all the sugar and stuff inside of a mason jar or something. Do this instead. Yeah. And again, the flavor is just on point. There's no cooling effect because she's using allulose. Easy to make. Easy to make. So yeah, absolutely. I would honestly recommend this. Okay. So let's talk about the giveaway. So Mm -hmm. there are several different flavors that you can choose from. They have mocha. We have a couple of these in the house. Uh, We have mocha. We have peanut butter. Mm. Uh, They have chocolate. They have a lemon poppy seed, which we've tried that it's one. Really that good. one was really good. Crazy good. Then there's also an orange almond, which we have not tried that one. We have one. not tried that yet. So definitely need to try it that one. Sounds good. Yep. Um, so, and then you have obviously pumpkin spice. Which I highly recommend. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. Uh, we're going to run the giveaway for one week. I'm okay. going to leave the date here along the bottom of the screen for when uh, you have to enter by. Mm-hmm. Uh, you need to be subscribed to the channel. You need to uh, obviously like, hit the like button on this video and then leave a comment down below. Any comment will do. Any comment you want to leave. Uh, now, the giveaway is only open up to um, people from the continental United States. She's going to be mailing it to them, though. And she's going to mail it directly to them. Okay. So, so once we have the winner, uh, we'll ask the winner to let us know what flavors and then Allie will mail it right out. So, awesome. So on that date, we'll do a little separate video and we'll ship it right out. Well, that is our video for today. Let us know down in the comments section which one of these flavors intrigues you most. Yeah, and also, what flavor of muffin are you missing that's still that's not on the market yet? Banana nut. Ooh, there you go. There's a good idea. Yeah, absolutely. So uh, please do us a favor and hit that like button down below. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the little bell icon, and that way every single time we upload a new video, you'll be alerted to it. Until next time. Bye. bye.